G'day guys, you're with Craig and this video is a video about an alternative to Ahrefs. Now, I work on my own, I'm not part of a big agency, so my needs you know, could be different to yours. However, uh, I have a lot of customers, I do SEO work and I do affiliate marketing and the tool that I'm recommending does everything I need at a quarter of the price. So I love it for that reason. <laughs> Now, I'm not going to go through and go through every single thing in Ahrefs and compare bit by bit because we could be here all day. Plus, the wording I find is really difficult to actually put things side by side. But the tool I'm recommending, if you go and dive in, there's a link below this video. You can go and get a free trial, of course. Uh, have a look at what it can do, what it can't do. I'm going to show you inside the tool very, very shortly, but you'll see... The pricing is out of this world. So the one I'm paying, I think it's round about, I'm only doing 250 keywords, and that gives me 5,000 keyword checks in total. So all these things that they've put in here is actually, you know, when you go back and look at what it actually provides, you sort of just, I just don't get it. Why don't they just say 5,000 keywords instead of 250, whatever. Um, now, you know, as far as projects go, what I do is with the clients, um, I can increase that. So if I go up to 500 keywords and I can go to more clients, you know, up here, you can change all these things, pay monthly every three months, uh, your rankings, get them every three days, every day, weekly. So what it does, it gives you some options compared to Ahrefs that has one price for all, doesn't matter, you know, and you know, in there, it's still a bit limited of what you can actually do as far as the projects go. So uh, I am using it, I'm loving it, and the pricing is really, really, really super good. So I'm only doing my updates every week, and that saves you 40%. You know, obviously, if you want to do it daily, it's going to cost you more. So let's dive in, and I'll show you uh, how it all works and how I'm using it. And the support from these guys is superb. They have a, a you know, online chat thing. You can jump in and ask questions. Uh, now, today's Sunday. They won't be online on a Sunday, but yeah, it doesn't matter. Let's dive in and have a look. Okay, I'm inside the tool. As you can see, I, you can run projects. Uh, you can do competitive research on a uh, website and find out what it is ranking for, how strong it is, the domain name value, all that sort of stuff. Keyword research, and it's got an incredible filter in there like Ahrefs says, so you can just put a broad keyword in and then apply the filter to go down to the low competition keywords. Backlink check, uh, checker for anything else, and it's got a few, uh, your report builder, there's a few tools there like uh, on-page SEO checker, search volume checker, there's a lot of stuff in here, okay? And then over here, we've got uh, rankings, we can talk look at rankings, get the historical data, we can look at analytics and traffic, uh, we can do audits, there's, uh, we can you know, track against competitors, we can set out a marketing plan to rank number one for that keyword, we can do, it's got a great auditing function, the same as Ahrefs has, uh, and, and we can you know, use that and convert that into a project, convert that into a marketing plan. Uh, what else is there? That's the backlink section. We can do, yeah, look for disavow, backlinks, um, you know, the, the recommendations for disavow. It's got everything you will need. And depending on how many clients you've got, or if you're working for yourself, you might just be working on your own sites, you know, you don't need to pay $99 a month. You can use this tool here and it will do everything you want it to do. Right, let's go and check out some of the actual user uh, things. I'll just do a quick one now. This is the competitor research and you know, I'm in New Zealand. You can choose USA, United Kingdom. I mean, all the countries are on there, Australia. So they are pretty well covered for your area. But I'll just go and grab a domain name at random. So we'll dive in. Now this site here is a, it's a pet site. So I just grabbed it at random. It's just the first thing that came up. And we can see this one's got a domain trust of 68. It's got 1.3 million uh, traffic thing from organic traffic, which is pretty cool. Uh, now you can actually add this as a project if you wanted to, you know, very easy just by clicking that. But then it can go, you can go through and look, and this is quite interesting here. You can see that the organic traffic January 2020, I mean, these guys have really been cranking up traffic organic and getting a lot more you know, traffic from when they first started. They've gone from 348,000 up to, 
1.6 million. So these guys are really into it. Now you can go through and have a look at the detailed report and just find out what keywords are actually ranking for. So they've got 555,000 keywords they're ranking for. And you can put a filter on here, you know, work out uh, the difficulty score between zero and say 10. Look at all the low comp keywords. And you can see things like, you know, short tailed dogs, 880 searches a month. These guys are, you know, the difficulty score out of 100 is number eight. So that's one, you know, that would be quite easy to go for. Natural deworming for cats. Uh, how to sedate cat, you know, deworm cats naturally. So you sort of get the idea. You can get a lot of ideas for articles and things that you can rank for by using this tool. And there's a heap of other things in there. But I just want to go through really quickly and show you how I'm I'm using it. Okay, I'm not going after cuteness, by the way. I just grabbed that as a uh, as a uh, example to show you. So you can go through UK, Australia, India. Uh, I'm not sure what that one is actually. Greece. I'm not sure. Sorry, <laughs> if it's your flag. So then keyword research works very very similarly. If you want to come down here and just grab one of these keywords, just click on it, and you're straight into the keyword research part of the tool shows how difficult the difficulty how many searches there is dog humping cat I am terribly sorry I didn't even see that before I put it in but yeah there we go there's lots of traffic about well there's a product okay so here's your traffic there's your product a hump pillow okay guys I am terribly sorry about that. that was purely accidental but look I've just gave you a great idea for a niche 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 depending where you are in the world you could do an, an article about your dog humping a cat and give them a hump pillow as a recommendation. Great affiliate product. 60,000 people a month looking for it. See, you get all the ideas with Craig. I'm, look, I'm looking after you. Okay, uh, that's competitive research. Now, project, I won't go into projects because I've got projects there and obviously you'll see all my projects. I don't really want to do that, but it's the same thing. It's tracking keywords. It, tracking, uh, you know, it does an audit on the site. You're getting all the updates the same as you do with Ahrefs. So every week you get something... You know, put out if it's weekly and it's showing you, you know, the errors on the site the um, 3xx is all that sort of stuff that you know everything you need to know is on this platform now as you can see down here there is a um, an online chat now then they're off chat at the moment um, because it's Sunday and these guys don't work on the weekends which is totally fine uh, but you put in put in a um, Put in the question over the, on the weekend and you know, Monday morning they'll answer it for you. So then backlink checker, you know, same as every other tool around, does a fantastic job. Just enter the domain name there. Go search. There it is. Backlink. 774,000, 5,000 domain names. So, you know, this site, uh, I don't know how old it is, but these guys are really cranking out the content. So, uh, yeah, it's an affiliate site. Uh, I think it actually might be owned by uh, one of the big companies and they're probably promoting their own products. products. So someone like Procter Gamble or something like that, they are getting into this affiliate space as well. And uh, But yeah, you can go through and look at the back links there. And yeah, I've just blocked out my projects for, you know, obviously uh, the project. So yeah, look guys, that's probably enough. That's eight minutes worth of thing. But I suggest you give it a try. Um, I'm really super impressed. I'm so glad I found this tool and it was hard to find this one. I've got to be honest. It was really hard to find it. The only way I found this tool was through a uh, Facebook group and someone was talking about it and that's how I found it because I've been searching for alternatives, Ahrefs, and no one is recommending this and I don't understand why because it will do the job at a quarter or a fifth of the price. Hope you enjoy it. Click the link, get a trial. Uh, I am an affiliate for it. Just putting it out there now. If you buy through my link, I will get paid a commission. But that's not the reason for doing this video. It's just to get, uh, just to support these guys because I think they are doing such a great job. And I just have never come across them. No one that I know seems to have heard about them. And they've been going for a while. They've got 500,000 users. So I'm actually really interested to try and do an interview with the owner of the business and see if he's keen to have a chat because I want to know the history about them, how they got started, and I'm just you know, fascinated to know because it's, I think it's going to be a good story. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. All the best. Cheers. Bye.